Hey guys, welcome back to this play Xenoblade Chronicles Blind. The time is upon us. It has arrived. So I'm having these three in the party, at least for now. I changed all of their gear. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I uh, went for what I thought looked best. Um, well, I kind of like balanced it between what looks best and what's actually good. Um, unfortunately, all of Shulk's armor looks like poop. Um, yeah. Uh, but he looks like this. He has all this on. Just let you have a look at this for a sec. Yeah, it's very exciting. And then, uh, this is Melia. She doesn't have the, the 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 cleavage window anymore, and she also isn't like doesn't have her stomach showing. She does have the side showing, but that's not so bad because it's like if she gets stabbed there, it's not quite as horrible as getting stabbed like in the chest. Um, <clears throat> and somehow the boots manage to go really well. Oh, never mind. They're, they're all part of the same set. That's why. Anyway, yeah. So this is what she's wearing. I don't really like her glasses that much. But there was I don't think there was anything else that really was good. It was as good. I don't really like her wearing glasses, but alas, like as you can see, everything else is so shitty in comparison, so um it's whatever I guess. Also I realized you can open this, which I I already knew you could open this, but I didn't realise you could just keep it open. <laughs> oh, it's good that I'm learning about these things right at the end. It's great. Yeah, so like I didn't really want her to have like this on. Uh, it looks okay, but it's too shitty. I think, yeah. No way. Oh shit, that's not what she- oh shit, what did she have on? These? Master glasses? Yeah, it's not look how much better those are. So, yep, she gets to wear glasses, I guess. But anyway, so she has this on, all the ether in the world, um, and stuff. I didn't change her stuff, and still not sure if I should. Wait, what did this have again? Yeah, it just doesn't seem that good. Look at... Yeah, I don't know. But I did, I did put an HP up into her something. Oh no, she already had that on, right? From before? No! No, yeah, yeah, no. I, I moved it here to this. I also put in this debuff resist and this recovery up. I don't know how useful that is, but whatever. And then we have Riki! Ah, <gasps> oh, look how cute he looks! Oh, look at the Riki! It's funny because these are like, this is like heavy armor, I think. But it like, or me no, it must be medium. But it like, somehow it goes, because it's like the same color. Oh, <laughs> so cute Riki! Yeah, so I have that on him. Um, it's mostly this, yeah, this Hirax stuff. He's like the only person with a Hirox stuff actually looks any good. And I put this on him. Um, I did have something else on him before. It was like this. But I realized his auto attack damage, I don't know if that matters that much. And I mean, I don't really like the way this looks, but it has like all this stuff, which if he's tanking would be really useful. We'll see. Anyway, I might change it around. I also put on extra debuff resist for him here. So his debuff resist is 50%. Which is like, whew! And then his ether is like all the way up there, so that's good too. Hmm. <clears throat> oh, he hasn't... Oh no, yeah. Yeah, it's like, it's maxed, so it's good. It's capped. It's good! And then Shulk, I tried to kind of give him agility, but... I mean, his stuff was just kind of... Nah, yeah, whatever. Um, I didn't look at our... Oh, I didn't look at our skillings yet. Oh, shit. Okay, give me a second. I need to, like... <sighs> Make sure everybody has everything good on and stuff, so... One second. Okay, so this is what I have on Melia. Um, she just basically has all the orbs, except I think there's one she's missing. This one. Agility. Oh, that could But she can only have three things up at a time anyway. So, yeah, so I have... So she has... This will... Okay. So I have the summon copy. I have the earth. I have the water. I have the flare. I, get, uh, I have the bolt. And the ice. Because ether damage is probably useful. Or reduction. I have this on still. I have this reflection thing, just in case that's a thing that's necessary. I might switch. Oops. I didn't mean to... 
switch these so the heels are like in the same place. It's gonna fuck me up because I've had the heel one for the longest time over here, but anyway. <clears throat> yeah. So that's her. Okay, this is Riki's, um, uh, he has this on, Riki is angry, bitey bitey, so that's like bleed, he has poison, uh, <clears throat> I switched this one out, um, this was originally sneaky, because if he's gonna be tanking, I don't know if he will necessarily keep aggro, but the idea is that he's tanking, so <clears throat> he's not really gonna be behind the enemy, so I'm gonna do say sorry instead, because this thing like gives a lot of um, debuffs and stuff, so hopefully that will be useful. Um, and then he has this, which he already had on, and this, and this, and this, which he already had on. I don't know if he really needs AoE, but whatever. I was kind of hoping we'd be able to fill all these up, but alas. Anyway, so, yeah, I just did that. Kind of wonder if there are two more skills he's going to get. Hmm, I don't know. And then he has all of that. Now I'll have a look at their skill things. <clears throat> But I'll do this off screen. Okay, I'm gonna keep Melia on this tree. Um, <clears throat> increases agility, uh, boosts wind damage. I mean, I don't really know how useful this is. Um, but we get this Ether Up buff at the start of the battle. And I actually, maybe this one's better. Mm. <clears throat> okay, Melia's gonna be on this one. <clears throat> oh. Oh, and critical hit rate, though. Oh. But this one has more HP. More HP absorbed. I mean, there's this one, that whatever. Extends chill duration, I guess, could be useful, and greatly increases ether. So this is more like a healy one. I'm kind of sad that we don't have the extra crit. Ooh. But yes. Oh! Okay, all right. I just looked up whether or not we actually have to select a thing, and we don't. I mean, we do, but it, all of these are active all the time. Which I did not know. So, never mind, go back to Melia. We're gonna do this one. Okay, critical hit, it's good. What was her other one? Proof physical defense could be useful, but... I think critical hit is good for her. Ah, <sighs> Riki! <clears throat> Max HP, I don't think we need. Ether defense... Agility. I think Ether Defense. <clears throat> and then Shulk. Block rate. Ether. Agi agility. Alright. Okay. Now we get to do the skill links. This I will do off screen.
Okay, this is what I have on Malia. So there's nothing from Riki because everything is party. There's not much from Shul because everything is party. Um, and they're in the party. But I have this. Grant physical protect to battle. Uh, to, I mean, what? Grant's physical protect to party with battle star affinity. Party thing. We have so many affinity coins now. It's so nice. Um, increases ether. Obviously useful. Uh, boost physical defense and ether defense. I don't. Uh, this doesn't seem to be a party one, so I put this on her. And then allows medium weight to be. She already had that because she has medium weight on. Uh, medium weight armor on, I believe. Boost physical defense when HP is at half, I think is quite useful for her. Um, all the other ones on him are like, with higher level enemies, with higher level enemies. And I don't think we really have any higher level enemies now, so. Um, I mean, maybe we do. I can change it later. Anyway, it reduces the effects of spike attacks. Increases the damage of critical hits. These are all party things, which is very nice. Fills the party gauge of two allies are incapacitated. Yay. So we have this now on because she actually knows that skill, which is good. We have rarely grants haste buff at start of battle. Reduces ether damage taken. And then I ran out of options. So that's what she has. Now I'm going to do the Okay, these are Riki's ones. So he has a lot from Melia. We have increases ether, increases strength during the night, increases agility, increases ether. And we had wait, how much do those cost? Okay. Um, then from Charlotte, he has increases ether, uh, physical defense and ether defense. Medium weight to be equipped, blah, blah. Uh, restores HP to an encouraged ally, useful. Uh, and I put this on him because he had some coins left over, um, just in case. Um, improves physical and ether defensive light equipment, which is good because he has a lot of light equipment on, so hopefully that really boosted him a bit. Um, increases counterattack rate when HP is a half, and increases damage at the first strike of battle. Now I'm going to do Shulk. Okay, and this is Shulk's. He doesn't get to have as much stuff. Because... He doesn't. He's not cool enough. Yeah, but he has some pretty good stuff on. So he has this uh, increase his strength during the day. I have stores HP when dealing a critical hit. Um, increases agility when HP is at half. Sorry, just checking. I don't really have this stuff on. Um, improves physical and ether defense of light equipment. Yeah, because he has some light equipment on. 
Further increases max HP, allows heavy weight armor to be equipped because he has some of that on. And that's it. I was really hoping to get this one. Oh, I'm only three affinity coins away. Oh, three affinity coins. I don't really want to get rid of any of this. I guess I could get rid of this one. Yeah, okay. Because that would be really nice to have. There we go. Okay, so this is what we have. Let's go! Let's go. Oh, that's not the way. That's a wall. <laughs> it's a wall. It's embarrassing. Ah, uh, let us go. Come on. There we go. Look at Ricky. He's so cute. <laughs> <laughs> Tiny baby Ricky. Before we step into this, let me just check. Whoops. One last thing in the Collectopedia. Oh, we never got this from Colony 6. Ooh. Alright, we're gonna go. Let's go. There's a lot of the. There's still other stuff in the Collectopedia I don't have, but whatever. Oh wait, let me save. Oh shit. Oh, I almost didn't save. Why can't I save? I can't save here? Oh, I just couldn't save on the teleport. That's weird. Okay. Alright. Let's go. Wait, maybe I could save up there. It's just I was standing on the teleporter or something. Oh, yes. It's fine. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. Hi. Hey, let's go. Oh, I'm excited. <clears throat> I'm okay. My oh, you are nine, Dana. Night to it. Oh, yes. I mean, sorry, I mean, yes. Yes, this is a very exciting cutscene we have seen already. Yes. Yeah, let's go. Okay. Ha, ba, 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 ba. Boo, I still can't believe Hulk Hogan is the evil one behind all this. Terrible. Okay. Do do do. We finally got past that cutscene. It was a long cutscene. <laughs> uh. Uh. But anyway. Oh yeah. No, we weren't standing on a teleporter. Yeah. No. Bam bam bam. Oh. Oh right, because we haven't been here on the save. <laughs> That's funny. Did I save before I came in here? Yes, I did. Okay. Did I? <gasps> no, I did. Right. Please tell me I saved. Dixon-san! Dixon-san! Here we go! Look, he's not yellow anymore! Isn't that nice? Ah... Uh, okay. I mean, I'm sure this will still be a difficult fight, but... You know. <sighs> Stand over here. Do that. I feel so prepared. It's so nice. It's such a nice feeling. Probably gonna regret saying that, but anyway. Mm -hmm. Oh, Shulk has aggro? Oh well, I guess that's fine. I mean, he has high agility, so it should still work out, I guess. <gasps> Riki doesn't have 9999 HP anymore! Oh, poor Riki. I'm actually kind of surprised that our HP is so low, considering the level that we are. Usually in a Final Fantasy game, our HP would be, like, at level 80-something, our HP would be at, like, 8,000 or so. Or 7,000. I thought they said you woman. I was, I was about to get very angry. Oh, Field has something to say about that. フィオル。思いか。そいつは腹が膨れるのか。気に入らない奴をぶっ殺してくれるのか。あなたはなぜ戦うの?残座に力を貸して何もかも滅んだ世界で。あなたはそんな世界が楽しいの?違う。残座な
巨神界と鬼神界の全ての命が一緒に生きていける世界を望んでた私はあなたを許さないそうだよだが何ができるんだよその体で I kind of like kissed this with the glasses on. So, yo, Hoshimo no Tenny Reno, Sinde Mamorna de Dame. Oh, I didn't realize his sword did that. That's cool. Mona do an actor, oh, my, a conna at your tioid. Oh, he pissed the monitor, so it's fine. Oh, look at him. He's so cute. Heheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheh
I know there are a lot of people who really don't like to do this, but I like to get to like the highest level with the best stuff and collect all the things and whatever, and then when we, when we get to the final boss, it's easy. I mean, well, it's not necessarily easy, but it's like, it's not too stressful. Um, yeah. And I was actually thinking, I'm just going to talk about this while we do this. I was actually thinking um, the other day that, um, I was thinking, I thought I remembered that I would play the beginning of a Final Fantasy game, get stuck early on, and then use a walkthrough, but actually, that's not what happens, or used to happen. I would play through pretty much to the end of the game, and then get stuck. Or I would get to the point of no return and be like, okay, let's go back, and start again with a walkthrough and make sure I get everything. I think that's what I used to do. So... Uh, yeah, and then Final Fantasy IX was the first Final Fantasy I played where I went all the way to the end without a walkthrough at all. And then I went back and like 100% of it later, which you can't do because of the dumb ultimate weapon of uh, Steiner. But anyway, still, yeah. So, yeah. Mm hmm? Yeah. Which is a very... It was like a nice experience. It was so different to what I was used to, so... Man, this is so easy now. Look at this. <laughs> I feel kind of bad. <laughs> oh, it's so satisfying because we worked so hard to get here. Like, it's not just like this boss is easy. It's like we worked hard to be better than it. So it's... It's worth, in my opinion. Oh. Okay. So I can't believe this guy. Oh god. Oh. Uh, what? That's funny. That's funny. That never happens. The villain's always like, No, I'm gonna... But he was just like... He's just like... Nah, that's okay. Oh, look at him. You crying? No. Oh, never mind. I thought he was sad, but he didn't seem that sad. Hmm. But oh, he is dying. Oh. oh, that's what's happening. I see. It sounds like he's dying. Mm. Oh, he is dying. Oh god! Oh, I thought he was gonna land on his crotch. Oh. Oh, he's crying! Oh no, it's raining. Just kidding. Rip. I mean, I still can't believe that he's the bit. Hmm. Oh, Hulk Hogan. <sighs> Poor Hulk Hogan. It's kind of sad. Oh, look, it's space. Okay. I forgot about this. I, I forgot that we had seen stuff in space happen. And this guy with the beautiful hair. なぜだ。なぜここから先が見えない。うん。二つの物だと手にした今。この世界の因果の流れは我と共にあるはず。これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ、これ
バカなテレシアの力が弱まっている赤のごとき矮小な生命に遅れを取るだとこの世界はあなた方のもの神にも必要のない世界を作ってください使ってください神のいらぬ世界だとふん<笑>神あってこその世界だここは我の世界なのだ Why does this boy sound so familiar? Oh, that's so pretty! Also, I guess we're in space now. That's fine. And we are in rings. But we seem to be orbiting Jupiter. No, we're not on Bionis anymore. What is with the firing thing? What is that? What, like, what's that thing? Oh, Saturn. Right. Sure. Okay, we've made it to Saturn. Good landmark, guys. What is this? Is this the road? Oh, weird. I'm surprised we're walking. I expected us to be like... This is so pretty though. Holy shit, look at that. <gasps> so pretty. I expected it to be like... I thought we'd be swimming, but okay. Swimming in space. I like how it's on an angle too. It's kind of funny. Oh. It's Mumka's spirit, I guess. Are we fighting this? I guess we are. I mean, we could have just passed it, but I'll fight it. For story purposes. Is the music different? Hard to tell with all the screaming. Oh, okay. Oh, that was not very much experience. This is so pretty! This is like some Final Fantasy XIII kind of stuff. Actually, this is like every Final Fantasy ever kind of stuff. Is this the way? Yep. It is. Okay. Can I go back if I stand in this? Oh, I can. Hmm. Okay. Alright. Anyway, let's go. Naru! Hello, gorgeous baby! You came to look at- Oh, now we're in Jupiter! Oh, oh my god, we're going around the solar system! That's so- What is that? That is so cool! Oh, look, I'm- Oh, look at the fucking horrifying map, though. Hey, Naru, look! Look, we're playing Elite Dangerous! Is that the sun over there? This is so... fucking cool. I would just like to say, this is actually amazing. Holy shit. It's also horrifying, because we're just standing in the abyss of space, but... What is that? Holy fuck, this is so cool! You guys, this is so cool! Ooh, I'm okay. Spirit. Zord. Ah yes, I remember you. In the ether mine. I remember you. Is this what heaven looks like? We just hang around in space? Hey, I wouldn't be... I wouldn't, you know, that'd be pretty cool. I would get kind of boring after all, I guess, but, you know. Oh man, this is so amazing! Oh. Oh. oh, we're in space! Like climbing a hill, okay. Hey Jupiter, how's it going? Uh, did you know that Jupiter has rings? Why does this Jupiter not have rings? Hmm? Hmm? Oh, they only discovered not that longer. Oh, it's okay. <clears throat> it's still weird to me that Jupiter has rings. 
Mars! Oh, we're at Mars now. Oh, hello, Mars! Hello? Oh, now it's getting, it's getting darker. Getting darker. Oh, this guy was banished to Mars? That's kind of unfortunate. Wait, is this a... Oh, it's just a Talisha. I mean, it's like a Talisha, it's not like THE Talisha. Can we not have to fight her brother, please? Because I don't think I'd be okay with that. And by don't think, I mean I would not be okay with that. Why are we missing? It's below us, come on. Oh, maybe it missed us. Oh, no. This is so fucking cool. Holy crap. And it's dead. Whoa, look at all that. Oh, it's so shiny. I guess there's a meteor shower happening. Okay. Oh, this is so cool! <laughs> oh, ah, this makes me happy. Let's go. Oh, did I go the wrong way? Oh, no. Moon! Oh, okay, we're at the moon. Oh, the moon's kind of boring, but okay. Cool. Cool, look, it's the moon. Yay. <laughs> oh, is that Earth over there? I mean, the moon's cool and all. It's just, you know, it's the moon. We've been to the moon, so... Whatever. Gadolt! I don't want to fight Gadolt! Rip. <sighs> oh, exploded into a lot of yellow orbs. We're making our way to Earth and the Bionis or something. Very interesting. Oh. Kire. Kire. Are wa. Mizu no katamari. What? Kyoto kita ne. Shuruku. Kimi wa. Do shita no shuruku. Tanoshimi ni shite iru yo. Kimi ga eranto ni michi yo. That's thing in the jig. My choice. It's a uh, all of these, isn't it? <gasps> Is that a black hole? <gasps> why? No, why are we here? No, I don't want to be in the black hole. No, why do you do? Oh, why do you do this to me? Oh, hello. Yep. Oh, Zanza. そう。本来であれば我は主力から得たこの体をより白として次の千年を生きるつもりだった。うん。だが、思いがける力が手に入ったのでね。メイナスのモナド。そうだ。お前に預けてあった我のモナドだけでなく、もう一つの創世の力を
テレシアに変えられた者たちよ私がどんな思いで打ち果たしてきたかいえ何を言っているあの姿こそが彼らの本質変えたのではなく戻したのだテレシアは我の細胞の一部それに戯れに知性を与えてみたのがハイエンターに代表される原初生命たちなのだ<笑>つかの間といえど知性体の真似事ができたのだ感謝してほしいところだななるほど造物主の思い上がりというわけか本来巨神界の生命と我が存在するためのよりしろであり勝手だ巨神界とはそれらのムクロと生命エネルギーが積み重なったものに過ぎないだが全能を気取ろうと貴様はハイエンターによって監獄島にとらわれていたその程度の存在だとらわれていた我はただ休息していただけだあー、そういう、そういう。メーナスのよりしろとの争いで、我も傷ついていた。ビジョンで知った新たなよりしろの誕生。その日を待ち続けていたに過ぎぬ。それが、僕だと。そうだ。お前の体を得て、我はメイナスとの戦いに再度望むつもりだった。Uh -huh. だが。あれが最後になるとまでは思わなかったよメイナスうわおけいわれにもなどをもたらした子を持ってそなたを新たな人にジョストしようシュルクリョ断るお前のよりしろにも使徒にもなるつもりはない僕はただのホムスとして生きていくだけだお前のいない世界で残念だ。すべて終わりに油断。私は水の時を得れば良いもの。だが、それが知性体というものの宿業かもしれない。自らの力、技術で世界を変えようとする。それは神のみに許された技だ。鬼神界を滅ぼした理由はそれか。そうなんだ。そうだメイナスを報じていたマシーナという者どもあれもまたメイナスの庇護のもと不尊な進化を遂げつつあったからな<笑>そんでもって次は俺たちホムスの番ってわけかいその通りホムスの、oh、危険な種族であることをお前たちが証明しつつある残念だ我は友人が欲しかった I had a desire for friendship. 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 I mean, there are other ways. 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 やはりお前たちに考える心などは過ぎた代物であったようだだがもうじき全て終わるテレシアが巨神界の生命を食らい尽くすその後我は新たな世界を創生しようこれまで幾度もそうしてきたようにさせない絶対に僕たちが止めてみせる Sure, we will. Okay. Let's go. Oh. Oh, it's red. Oh, I can change our equipment and stuff. Nah, that's okay. I'm good. Oh, Christian Mark. Sentient Genesis. Okay, sure. Oh, there are other things. Hello. Let's fight this thing. Oh, sorry, sorry, I'm not saying. Okay, hello, yes, I'm here, I'm talking, hello. Oh, resist, okay. Sorry, I'm so used to just fighting things off screen. <laughs> But c can we, like, seriously, can we please not be heading into a black hole? Because that would be great. Thank you. I would appreciate if we were not. 
I don't know if that's really what this is, but it seems like it. Okay, can it can can we not though? Uh -huh. Can we over here now? Oh, let's do this. Let's do this for theatrics. Look at the fucking horrifying minimap though. Um I should have tried to open the map. Maybe it would have looked interesting. Oh well. But why am I doing this? Uh-huh. Oh well. Let's do purple, I guess. Should have cut! You don't have any purple stuff, rip. Guess you can do this thing. Huh. Oh, I missed it! I'm disappointed in myself. Oh well. Yay, we're so over leveled! Mo ha 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 ha! Yes! Good. Good. Da da! Okay, you do that. I bet Maynith will come in somehow. Magically. Or her monodol will be like, no. Ah? Uh, ah? Uh, no? Okay. A united world. That doesn't sound so bad. Oh, oh okay. No, I don't need. Alright, second form, I guess. Sure. Did he grow? Or is it just me? I really don't want to stand between you and the black. Oh god, that's horrifying! Oh no! I don't need to look at that. Oh, that's scary! No, I don't want. I was gonna stand behind him, but I don't want to go near that horrifying background. No, no. Oh, that's scary as shit. Look at it. Oh, actually, that's more like a wormhole than a black hole, so that's okay, I guess. But it's still horrifying. Oh, there's the black hole over there. Oh, oh, was it just the other side? I'm so con oh, I can't tell which way we're going. It's so messed up. Feels like motion sickness and juicy. Uh. Da -da -da -da. Oh, what? Oh, okay. What was that? Titan Bazooka. Oh, rip. Shulk, save me! Shulk! Save me, somebody save me! He can't do anything? Why did I do... Here, do this. Help me, I don't want to die. Ooh! Ooh. Okay, it's okay, I'm alive. Oh, I could have done my counter. Oh, there's so safe black hole! No, I don't wanna... Naru! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh ho ho ho! Oh, there is a black hole after all! Ha 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 No! Naru, save me! I don't want anything. <laughs> I don't want. Oh. Oh, sorry, got some time. Yeah. 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 それはあなたもよく分かっているはず。これまでそうしてきたのはあなた自身なのだから。それは神のみに許されたわけだ。Is 
そんなことは重要じゃない選び取ろうとする意志掴み取ろうとする力僕らは今、うん、それを手に入れたあ,あそれはモナドあ,あなただけに選ばせはしないこの世界に生きるもの全てに選ぶ自由があるそれが未来よ第三のモナドだと何そんなものがなぜお前たちごときが Can we destroy the black hole with the monitor? Huh? Please. <laughs> Please. <laughs> Please. Oh. What is this music, though? No wonder the Dixon music wasn't that exciting. Yeah, I want to stand a bit. Stand over here away from the black hole thing. Oh, God, it's horrifying from this angle. Oh, my God. Oh, what's happening? Oh, what the f- hello? Oh, okay, we're- this reminds me of, um... This reminds me of Final Fantasy VII. <laughs> Actually. Not the story, just like, just this particular- It reminds me of, uh, I think it's Bahamut Zero's attack, or something. There's a lot happening right now. The, the music is a thing, and I- uh, oh, uh, oh. Can I zoom in a little bit? That's the bit. Or is that worse? Maybe that's worse. Prediction? Is that what you just said? Oh god, oh god, what's happening now? Oh. Oh, the, we're hurtling towards a black hole. Not to save me. The mini map in this area is so horrible. I mean, like, it's. Good, it's just like, it's like, it's just, it's wrong, and I don't appreciate it, and oh my god. <sighs> no, get away from the black hole! Oh no, look at it! Oh my god, it's so horrifying! I don't need the black hole. <laughs> Why do you do this? It's funny, because the symbolism is very, it's really good. Because a black hole leads to like creation. It's like a cycle, it's good. I mean, it's bad, but no, I mean, it's not bad. Oh, that's Olivius. There we go. Talking. Oh, Olivius is the mo. Okay. Yeah, it's Olivius. Uh, did we know this one? I feel like I knew this already. Maybe not. That makes sense though. That's so cool! He's like... It's like he's like the personification of the monodo. That's so cool. Oh. Yeah, of course, because he has the visions. Oh, it all makes sense now. Right down the middle. I fall into the black hole. Yep, you go into the black hole and we will go home. Can we please not fall into the black hole with you? That'd be great. Thanks. Hey, look, it's... Oh, I can't say that. Those of you who know, know what I was going to say. It totally is! Look! That's funny. I'm amused. Oh, yeah, that's right. 
Oh, that's what that thing is. To like terraforming the planet, sort of. Wow. Oh. Oh, you like simulated a big bang. That's great. Good job. Good job. Yeah. Oh, sure. <laughs> Oh, a universe. Oh, hello. Oh, poor Zanza. Sekaiが次の段階へ進もうとすれば巨神界に生命が溢れていたのもそれを刈り取るテレシアの存在も全てはザンザの意志だったのかそうだけど友人を望んでいたという思いそれもいつわりではなかったそれは about the Talisha that Alvis was on that someone in particular そのそう。だけど時は戻らない。神は自ら生み出した新たな神によって倒された。新たな神。そう。だからこそ僕は君の前に現れたんだよ。知るか。うん。アルビス。<笑> He's a monitor, here he said. そう展に実験施設を管理するコンピューター。ああ。君には理解できないだろうな。ああ、オッケー。ま、ただの機械さ。元の世界の僕はね。ああ、I miss new god.君たちは世界をこのまま停滞させるのか。ダグネ。次なる段階へ進化させるのか。選ぶのは君だ。Evolve。僕は残座の好きにさせたくなかっただけで、僕が神だなんて。だよな。お前が神様だなんて間違って
毎日少しずつねえそんな進化こそが世界にあガールだけど君の意識の中にある彼らの人格を再現させてもらったひどいな一人で何も決められないと思われてるんだ神なのにすまないこう見えて焦っているんだよ今のままだといずれこの世界は消滅してしまうからねうんそれで望むことは決まったのかな新世界の担い手よ教えてくれ君が決めるこの世界に Surely evolve wouldn't want it to stagnate 僕は決めないよ Why not? 未来は一人一人世界に住む全員で決めていくものだから、oh, well, okay. uh, I thought it was like the option to evolve I guess 僕がいや僕たちが望むのは It's like free will Oh, world with no gods. Okay. Well then, that's an option, I guess. So you just destroyed the Bionis and the Mekonis? Rip. But the Mekonis was. So, I mean, the Bionis was so cute. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, I think you just accidentally, accidentally destroyed the whole universe. Good job. And everyone on it. What have you done, Trulk? What have you done? Look, it's the birth of a new solar system! Ah, oh, that's so fucking cool! Oh, no, it's a galaxy. Sorry, just kidding. That was so cool! Well, I guess it's the whole universe, but still. That was amazing. I mean, I don't know about the models of it, but the visuals were amazing. Good job! Oh, that was good. That was good. That was that was beautiful. I just I can't. Yep. <clears throat> Hello, everyone. Oh, look, all the people living together and stuff. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that's nice. Oh. <laughs> That's really cool, I like this. This is nice. <laughs> oh, this is so cute! Oh! Oh! Squat jumps! Oh! メディアやバネアたちのおかげだなハイエンターやマシーナの技術大したもんだよ当然のことをしているまでです私たちが手を取り合って生きていくそれはメーナス様や兄エギルの願いでもあるのですから、うん、そうか<笑>いいもんだなこういうのはお兄ちゃんお兄ちゃんおおフィオルンかどうしたシュルク見なかったシュルクかそういやさっきラインたちとどこかに出かけた<gasps> Is she like a little kid? そう Has she been reborn? She sounded she sounds really young and she's really short いやなんでもない What? What? Does she have her body back but she's like a little kid? Huh? Huh? Are they kids now? Huh? Oh, she's not. Hey, Melia. That's okay. I'm here for you. What are you looking at? The sea? Hmm? So pretty. So pretty. I'm just thinking we're this from Fiora's point of view. Wow, that's so cool, Melia. Is that right? I didn't answer the question to the point of view. But I know, I know that feeling. There's a lot of things. Yeah. I thought it was. I'm grateful for you. 
そなたたちと出会えたことで私は多くのものを見聞きそして今ここにいることができるうんそれは私も同じありがとうメリアそしてこれから先もうんこれから先も What? Can I tell you? Okay. Oh, they're fishing! Just like in the heart to heart. <laughs> What's this music? Very <laughs> cute. Look at his little feet! <laughs> oh, you're so cute! Oh, you're so cute! <laughs> what is this song? <laughs> Luke, you're so amazing. I can't deal. <laughs> oh, you're so cute, I can't. <laughs> it's so cute. Oh my god, this ending. Assuming this is the ending. Oh, hey, Shulk. Your gear looks much nicer right now. She's so much shorter than him. Hmm. Oh, no, wait, she has a face. Oh, oh okay, do we have to look at her butt? Then it's... Oh, no, she's just fine. Okay. No, she's just human. Okay. I thought she was a kid, because she's, like, really short. Why well, is not. Hey, Fiora. Welcome back. What? <laughs> <笑>意外と似合っているなって。さ、そう。前みたいに伸ばそうと思ってるんだけど。ね。どっちが好き?どっちが好き?何よ。なんかすっごく適当なんですけど。ごめん。でも。いいよね。こういうの。うん。忘
Yay. Who voiced uh, Alvis? Hmm. Oh, I don't recognize the name. Mmm. Yay, we did it. Ah, we finished it. Whew. Whew. Man, that ending was good, though. I like the whole rebirthing of the universe thing. That was cool. Although, I like how Shulk was like, ah, uh, we just want to change it little by little, so World Without Gods would be great, and then he ended up, like, just doing what the other guy was going to do anyway. It's like, okay. <laughs> Good job, Shulk. But, um, obviously he did it better, but still, it's kind of funny. Um. Huh. Interesting. Very interesting game. Um. Yeah. It was, it was very, the story was pretty good. It didn't capture me as much as Xenogaz did. Um, there, like, there were some like, oh, what the fuck kind of moments and it was good. Um, like those moments were good. Yeah, yeah, it was, it was pretty good. It was pretty good. Um, I'm trying to honestly review this here. The combat was really frustrating most of the time. Like, it was a nice idea. I like the idea of playing an MMO on your own, sort of, and having the characters control themselves, sort of, and then like, but, and everybody has such a different battle style, which is cool, but it was it just, it felt very clunky and slow, and it was a little infuriating. But I can see what they were trying to do, and like I, like the game was so ambitious. There were so many things in it that were really kind of I haven't seen them before or anything, um, and like um, it was very in depth. But there were some things where it was like I wish they'd just kind of gone. Eh, maybe we should just take this out. Like maybe the gems weren't entirely necessary. Um, or, like, maybe some areas could have been simplified, blah, blah, blah. But, like, considering this was made for the Wii, like, it's so... There's just, like, so much kind of jammed in there. Which is, um, both good and bad, I think. Um, the music was unbelievable most of the time. Some of the music I was a bit eh on. I didn't really care for most of the battle music. Um, but... Uh, most of the area music was amazing. Um, I loved the, um... Actually, there were some mechanic aspects that were good, like how treasure chests never despawn. Even if you leave the area, even if you turn off the game and turn it back on again, they're still there. And that was really nice. Um, I don't think the collectibles thing was entirely necessary either. They could have probably taken that out. Um... I feel like it would be a very satisfying game to 100%. Just because there's so much to do. <laughs> um, what else is there? Um, I kind of feel like it was like Final Fantasy VIII in a way. Not in terms of the story or anything like that. But in the way that it's so ambitious. Like Final Fantasy, Final Fantasy VIII had a lot of stuff in it that was very different to the other Final Fantasies before it. And like... A lot of people don't like the battle system in that game, or like the junctioning system, or the GF system. Um, but it's different, like it's interesting and new and ambitious. And maybe it wasn't executed totally well, blah blah blah. But you know, you can kind of appreciate that they tried something new. And that's kind of what this game felt like for me. Like a lot of the stuff was kind of like, ugh, this doesn't really fit with me very well, but I can appreciate what they're trying to do there. It's pretty cool. Um... No, I don't think I will start a new game. Um, this game took me so long to finish. Holy crap. Holy crap. Did I talk about the areas yet? The areas were so beautiful. Um, they were just... Whew. God, I mean, okay, yeah, I had a lot of problems with the camera, and blah, blah. But, like, the actual drawing of the backgrounds and stuff, like, the scale was amazing. To find out that you're, like, actually on the back of a god or whatever, it's just like, or a titan or whatever, it's just amazing. Like, what the fuck? Yeah, so that was, it was really nice too. Um, I didn't really feel a lot with many of the characters. I liked Melly a lot. Shulk's alright. 
Fiora was okay. I wish that they had given me more time to get connected to Fiora before killing her at the beginning, because then I would have had more of an emotional reaction. I mean, like, I was kind of like, oh, what the fuck is happening? But I wasn't like, no, you kill, you know, like, I wasn't crying or anything, I don't think. So, um, it was a long time ago, I don't entirely remember. Um, there was a lot of really good angsty, like, oh, this is so fucked up kind of thing that kind of came over from Xenogaz, so that's good. I mean, I don't mean that it's related to Xenogaz, but it's like that same kind of feeling, like, oh, what the fuck? How can it possibly get worse than this bullshit kind of thing? And then it, like, totally twists as well. It's like, who you think's the villain isn't the villain, and whoo! Oh, yeah, that, that was good. That was really good. That rebirth of the universe at the end was just incredible. Um... And being in space is always good. Um, what else? Oh yeah, and then the boob physics, of course, was pretty unnecessary. And like, I appreciate that they made it so that the armor looked different. I wish that if the armor looked different, there was a way to kind of glam it. Glamour it so that it looked like armor that you liked, but you had the better stuff on. Um, because some of that stuff just looks so stupid. <laughs> Especially when you mix them. So that was a little disappointing. Um, I think the armor could have been, yeah, maybe a little differently designed, but... Um, but, um... It was just kind of like little nitpicks for me. Oh, hello. It's just kind of like little, yeah, just kind of like little things, um, for me, little, uh, little nitpicky things, um, that did ultimately sour the experience, but I'm not saying it's a bad game or anything. Most of the things that, that bothered me were things that would only bother me. <laughs> like, it, it doesn't make it a bad game. It's just, uh, stuff that didn't work well with me, like the camera. I don't think anybody else complains about the camera, but for me, it was just really... I don't know if I'm just super sensitive to game cameras or something. I don't know what it is, but yeah, and it was, that was uh, quite difficult for me. Maybe it's just because I had shitty glasses on before. I don't know. <laughs> but, um... Oh, what I was saying about the characters. Yeah, the, like, I mean, the, the story of the characters was interesting and stuff, but I, they, they were really, I don't know if you noticed, but there were really only a few characters I really felt a connection with. Riki, Melia, um, Fiora a little bit, um, Shulk, I guess, and then, uh, the others just kind of like, Huh? <laughs> Which is a shame, you know? Like, I wish I cared about them more, but I just didn't in the end, so... Um, as opposed to Xenogears, where I was, a, I felt a lot more connected to those characters. Um, and in Trails, I feel really connected to pretty much all the characters. Of course, I have my favorites in those games as well, but, um, you know... Just, I just felt a little bit more than in this game. Not that this game didn't have character development or anything. Obviously, with the heart to hearts and all that stuff, there was that. It was just, they weren't that interesting to me, I guess, is all. Just there, I just, yeah. But, ah. Riki, though. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, Riki. Oh, but that whole ending sequence was just like, whew, my goodness. Gracious. Goodness gracious. That was just, uh, yeah, that was really nice. Just, it was just, yep, yeah, mm-hmm. Yep, yeah, it was good. It was good. Olive's being the monitor slash computer is so cool. I like that idea so much. Urgh. And Melia's brother. Mm. <laughs> Why couldn't he have been a character? <laughs> ah, see, now I was upset when he died. I was, v or, 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 or rather, it was more when he was turned into a Talisha, but also when he died. Yeah, like, that That was very hard for me. <laughs> uh, I found a connection with him. Uh, but anyway, um, so, overall, it was an enjoyable experience. I maybe shouldn't have focused so much on the quests. Maybe just focus on the story a bit more. I think would have been better, but, oh well, I didn't, and so I didn't. Um... Uh, I am ultimately glad that I played this, um, absolutely, we kind of started off on the wrong foot at the beginning when I was a little overly complainy, but, uh, 
Yeah, no, it was good. It was very long. It was a very long let's play. <laughs> Especially because I had that hiatus in the middle of it. Oh, of course I did. Why wouldn't I have a hiatus in the middle of a let's play? Although, it wasn't entirely my fault because my laptop died. But anyway, anyway. Um, so, I am not going to be playing Xenoblade Chronicles 2 or Xenoblade Chronicles X next. I don't know if I will play either of those. I know people want me to. But it won't be for a while. Because I really want to... Well, first of all, I really want to focus on trails. Like, finishing trails. Um, and I really want to focus on Final Fantasy VI. Um, especially because I'm, you know, in the middle of moving at the moment. So, although by the time this one goes up, I don't know where I will be. I should be in New Zealand, but I'm not sure if I'll be recording again yet. Anyway, um... So, for a while, I'm just going to focus on those two Let's Plays. And I want my channel to go a little bit back to... PlayStation 1 SNES era games. Maybe PlayStation 2, maybe. But um, I really want to get into those like Square RPGs or Square Soft RPGs um, from, you know, like from 1999 or whatever. Um, because I miss playing those games. Like I'm a lot less grumpy with those, I think. I <laughs> got such Breath of Fire 3, <laughs> which goes never mind. But um, there, there are so many games I've wanted to play since the very beginning of my channel that um, have kind of got waylaid by playing um, very long modern games, which is fine. You know, I mean, I I enjoy playing modern games as well. Um, I just really kind of want to get back into that like nostalgic kind of like 1999 feeling or oh, whatever. But, um, <laughs> the controller keeps falling asleep. Uh, yeah, so I'm going to focus on those two. I need to finish Persona 3 at some point as well. Yeah, I need to, like, re-watch Persona 3 because I don't really remember Persona 3 because it's been a long time. So I need to, like, re-watch my Let's Play before I continue that game. And I need to figure out how to level without actually making the story go for like I don't I don't really I'm so stuck in Persona 3 so I don't really know what I'm gonna do. I might replay the entire oh no I can't do that because of all the all the stuff I'd have to repeat. I don't know what to do with Persona 3. I really don't. Maybe I should just move on to Persona 4. Anyway, um but I have big plans for when Trails is done. Um, I have big plans. I don't know if it's very exciting for anybody else, but it's very exciting for me, okay? It's just, there are just these games I've just really been wanting to play, so I'm just gonna... Brrr. Yep, so, um, there's a lot of... Yeah, so there the are PSX era games. PS1. Um, that's all I'm gonna tell you. And there are JRPGs. Yeah. I'm also thinking of going back to my old, like, formula, where I'd have, like, two RPGs and then one, like non-RPG game, maybe like a short game, something like Ori, um, or whatever. Anyway, if there's anything that you would like me to play, be sure to put it on my game request list. I do check that, especially when I just finish a Let's Play. Um, and I often stream stuff from that list as well. Um, I would also like to take this time to thank everybody for watching this Let's Play. Um, for those of you who stuck all the way to the end, I applaud you. <laughs> for putting up with me and my forever complaints um but uh and and getting through all of these quest videos if you manage to watch them all um i don't know why you would but thank you <laughs> i hope my rainbow slug musical will live on forever in your hearts <laughs> um but uh i also want to say thank you very much to all of my patrons um your name should be now on the screen. Um, yeah, I, I just, like, I... So, so, like, every now and then I'm just kind of like, people want to support me to that extent, and it's just, it's so heartwarming and nice, and it just really makes me want to continue doing stuff. Um, it's like, oh, man, yeah, like, whew, yeah, let's go. Broom, let's record the things. <laughs> it's good, it's really good. Um, and I really hope that my patron, well, I mean, I, I guess you do, because otherwise you wouldn't still be a patron, but um, I hope that my rewards are enough for you um, I like that. I mean, I, I hope that you um, get out of patron what you were hoping 
to get out of patron anyway um if you would like to become a patron you can have a there's the screen the screen yeah the screen link yep mm -hmm. the link on the screen you can go there or it should be in the description um there are so many different tiers and so many different rewards it's kind of overwhelming for me <laughs> um but for just one dollar a month you can have early access to my videos um you get them as soon as they're uploaded instead of having to wait for their scheduled day um, if you stick around to watch something else anyway. Um, and also, uh, patrons often help me decide on what to, uh, what to play next, um, and stuff. Especially with streams. Um, what else? What else? What am I missing, Naru? Ah, and, uh, one last thing, um, in the description of this video, there should be a link to my Discord. Um, that is where we all hang out, and, uh, it's a pretty friendly bunch there. Um, we, uh, yeah, lots of, uh, that's where I hang out, anyway. That's where I say most of my things. It used to be Twitter, but now it's Discord. It's easier on Twister. Uh, <laughs> it's easier on Twister. Oh my god. Oh, it's easier on Discord. Yeah, so that is the place for the things. Um, there's also, like, stream updates and all that kind of stuff goes there, all my YouTube updates and stuff. Um, but anyway, uh, I hope you have a good day or evening or night or whatever it is for you. And, uh, I will see you in something else. Hopefully. I hope you enjoyed this LP. Despite everything. Bye-bye. <laughs>